Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I have for you a printer, a very cheap printer. Now I shouldn't say a cheap printer because it stinks, but because it's an inexpensive printer. So this printer is a Canon PIXMA 3122. And this one I picked it up at Walmart for 35 bucks. By the way, I'm not paid by Canon or Walmart. So this guy was $34.99, I got it on sale. If you can pick it up at that price, that's an amazing price. It takes two cartridges. One of them is a color cartridge and the other one a black cartridge. The color cartridge has three colors, obviously, the magenta, the yellow, and the, the blue. That's easy and as well, you don't have to worry about buying separate cartridges for each color. You kind of just buy the one color cartridge. And also what's good about it is that there's some kits online, mainly this company. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's uh, BCH Technologies. And I'll talk about more about this uh, afterwards, but you can modify those cartridges so that way you can make them refillable. Here's the box. I didn't really do an, uh, an unboxing for this thing, but uh, this is the box right here. Again, it's the Canon PIXMA 3122. Uh, it takes the 245 XL and the 246 color XL. This features mobile printing, so if you have AirPrint on your phone, any iOS users, you can print out directly from your phone. You can also scan with the application, so that way you can place the scan and scan it and it'll upload it to your phone. And uh, as well as uh, copy, because it has a built-in copier right on the top. That's pretty cool about this printer. So it does all that for $34.99. I remember HP came out with the air print the very first time and the printers were over $100 when it first came out. But uh, I happen to have one of those, but a very poorly designed printer uh, leaked ink in between the uh, contacts for the actual cartridges and basically it ruined the printer. When I opened it up, it had corroded all the electrical connections to the actual little chip, so it was ruined. So this printer is very inexpensive, but it's made very sturdy. So the way you get it is this guy right here. I'll make, I'll put some closer up shots of it as well. But inside, if I turn it on, you can hear it working. So in here, you have the actual slot for the ink. You just kind of pull this right here, and the ink cartridges are right inside. Very easy, you just close that up. Your printed papers or sheets come out through the bottom, the black slot here, and up here is where you have the slot to place in your paper. Uh, there's only a few design things that I don't like about this printer, and what I'm gonna say is that since it has this open slot, if you happen to have paper and you put it in there and you leave it in there for too long, guess what? The dust is just gonna fall right in and it's gonna get all over the rubber pieces so it's gonna be very difficult to, you know, sometimes feed the paper to the printer. But as it is right now, it's pretty good. But uh, I'm just afraid over time all that dust is gonna accumulate and ruin the printer. But you can take off the paper if you want and just do that and close it up. But even if you close it up, there's a back port in the back. There's a hole in the back. I'll show you guys. There's a hole in the back that'll let all that dust in. Same problem. Uh, so just be aware of that on this printer because you don't really want dust inside of this thing. Because obviously, if you guys know, if you have an old printer, the dust will get caught on the little rollers and prevent from paper from feeding. That's what was happening to my HP. Same thing, the paper would get stuck on the inside because it would stop feeding because it would lose grip on the paper. But easy to use this guy, very simple to set up. You download the application on your phone and you or on your laptop. But in this case, I did my phone. Uh, you hook up to the Wi-Fi of the printer as soon as you hook it up It'll show up on your wireless network and you tell it what network you want to hook up to it'll hook up to the network And you're ready to go set up your network over the app And it's also very easy because you can just scan the QR code right here and It'll straight take you straight to the application so that way you don't even have to think about it You just kind of do it. It'll take you through the whole step. The printing quality is very good I'm gonna do a quick test run of the printer so there we go. So now I'm gonna do the uh, I'm gonna do a, an alignment check sheet. So I'm gonna print that out real quick. Let's see how long it takes. 
So there you go, it's taking in the paper. Like I don't mind right now as far as me wasting the ink. The reason is because I already have the order for the to convert these cartridges into a refillable tanks. Thanks to VCH Technologies, thank you guys. What it is, it's basically you're removing the top from it, you're placing a new top, gluing it on, and then basically removing the sponge on the inside to make it a refillable cartridge so you don't have to keep buying cartridges. And with these printers, these are probably the best printers to do that with because you can prevent the printer from telling you no I'm not gonna print because you're you're not using you know authentic Canon cartridges so you can actually override that the only problem is when you override it it doesn't give you the actual readout of the how much ink you have and that's taking quite a while so yes guys it's very easy to do again you can download the application so this is the application here I don't know if you guys can see that But uh, you download the application from the App Store. It is called Canon Print. Yeah, Canon Print. And it's very easy to use. You just, whatever whatever documents you have that you want to print, you can just do that automatically from your phone, from your MacBook, uh, from your tablet, whatever you have. Uh, it'll be recognized within the network that you have at home and it'll you can print whatever you want on it. I don't know if this printer is safe from uh, printing hacks that are on the internet. As you know, oh see, here we go. So that is the printer alignment. So now I'm gonna have to put this in here and place this on the corner face down, all the way in the corner. And then I have to hit the start button to do it. So place that in there, right in the corner it down this is to hit the black or so I'm assuming it's gonna scan the sheet and then it's gonna align the cartridges to whatever the sheet says so and by the way these are the instructions for the actual printer gives you step-by-step -step details on how to set it up it made my life easy so read it and I believe that's it printers aligned so yeah guys again if you guys are interested I'm gonna be putting a link in the description below in case you guys want to pick it up on Amazon or uh, I'll put a link for Walmart but I don't get like I'm not sponsored by Walmart I'm not affiliated with Walmart or whatever but uh, I'll put a link for both in case you guys want to get it at Walmart for the low low price of 34 34 buckaroos but yeah uh, I hope you guys like this video let me take off the paper and close this up so that way I don't get it dirty. So again guys, thank you guys for watching this video. I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.